Marcus, you join me here after a one-all draw, but a fantastic penalty save from yourself. I mean, we better start by talking about that one. Talk us through it. I mean, when you're 12 yards away from a penalty spot like that, what's going through your mind? Uh, well, I'd had no uh, previous record of where he'd been, so I think for left footers, I always try and dive to my left, like they're going across the body. Um, and thankfully, I dived the right way and got up and just threw myself at the second one. Thankfully, it hit me in the in the chest and uh, yeah but I think penalties are all a bit of luck but yeah. it's nice to save one here. Yeah I mean as you say it's nice to save it here you used to used to play here didn't you you had an, a season on loan here it's quite a successful one so yeah so what's it like coming back to a, a club that you've uh, been at before a bit was there a bit of stick maybe when you were up in, uh, in front of the home fans then? No no they were good I really enjoyed it here it's probably up to now my favourite time in my career hopefully at all the shot I can make it even better and top that um, but really enjoyed it here we did really well made friends for life whether it would be with the, the players I played with or, or the fans or whatever really enjoyed it um, and it's obviously great to be back here and it's not too much of a trip back compared yeah. to normal so that's good and a couple of other really good saves as well to be fair to you this game keeping the side in it um, yeah. you know that's a good part of your game your shot stopping by the looks yeah. of it isn't it yeah I, it's been a bit frustrating recently because we've not really I've not I don't think I've had the chance to make these sort of saves I think a lot of the goals are conceded from close in yeah. and whether it be two or three we conceded you know I look back and I'm, I'm annoyed we've conceded three but I'm looking back and I'm thinking oh I'm, there's not much I could have done mm. but it's nice to have made a few saves today to help the boys get a clean sheet it's obviously a disappointing result in the end um, but we were at our best today probably lucky to get a point how important is a clean sheet to a goalkeeper? A lot's made of it, isn't it? That it's yeah. a be all end all, it's like scoring a goal or whatever. Yeah. But but is it is it actually that important or is it maybe about the win or, or what? Um, I think it's more from your mental side, really. Yeah. I think if you don't get a clean sheet for a while, you sort of get a bit down. But we, I think we've had two so far, yeah. Halifax and uh, Ebsfleet, which, which is pretty good. Um, I hope we can get a few more. Um, but at the end of the day, it's just a three points. If, if we won 3 2 today, I will not care. Um, I, don't, I don't care about clean sheets, to be honest. Obviously, it, it'd annoy you if you go a long stretch without having one. But at the end of the day, three points is the most important thing. And it's disappointing not to uh, get them today. You get to see the whole game played out in front of you, don't you? You get a pretty good view of it yeah. from back there. So, so, what were your thoughts of today's game? Maybe yeah. one we should have won should have won or maybe uh, we were definitely there to win mm. um, I'm not sure if we deserved to or not um, we were pretty sloppy in the, all of us 1-11 to 11, we, were, we were sloppy on the ball at times um, I thought Boston were pretty good uh, going on the counter attack I think both, both, both sides were sloppy to be fair it wasn't a great game um, but I think they're the games that you know we're hoping for a bit of magic from James or JB or someone like that Kai um, but you can't, can't always rely on them sorts of players. Um, but point to point, it's away from home. And uh, if, if we can get a point away and, a, and wins at home, more often than not, we'll have a good season.